welcome to the video. We're still somehow jacked. Um, this is gonna be a weird one today. I don't even know what this video is about. Honestly, we're gonna talk about some stuff. We're gonna have a heart to heart. What's up? It's uh, 3 a.m. Uh, I can't sleep because I'm, I don't even know why, because I'm contemplating my entire existence, boys and girls. Entire existence. I have just had a perfect sleeping schedule. This whole time and now tonight i want to rethink my entire existence rethink my youtube rethink fitness what am i doing i don't know but um hopefully i can sleep the next morning <laughs> good job what a failure like usual Delicious. Bro, what is that? Piece of meat taking a bath? Yay! Oh, welcome to the video. We're still somehow jacked. Um, this is going to be a weird one today. We're going to talk about some stuff. Lots of stuff. So much stuff. Mind-breaking stuff. Mind-breaking? Mind-blowing? I don't know what the words are. I haven't gone to school in 17 days. I've been locked inside. I feel like I've been here for years. Whoa, such an angel. Still look like a homeless person though. That's okay. Sick angle. <sighs> Yo, remember how I couldn't sleep last night? Um, yeah, I still couldn't sleep, so I had to like literally go down here where I've been for two months. I don't even know what this video is about. Honestly, we're going to talk about some stuff. We're going to have a heart to heart. Uh, we're going to discuss why this is so focused on my face. Why are you so zoomed in? Zoom me out. Thank you. Okay. Um, yeah, went to sleep like 5 a.m. for the first time in like weeks because I've been having a proper sleep schedule. I've been maintaining my good habits. But then anyone else feel like uh, they literally went through like seven years of seven years of like life in the past like three months. I mean one month, even though Nobody's done anything. Just feels like I've been here for like seven years. I'll talk about some other stuff later on in the video, but like, I feel like my entire life has changed. But like, not in a positive or negative way, just in like a different way. I don't know. Great YouTuber. was a terrible idea cuz now it's raining and I'm pretty cold don't look at me sir I know I'm crazy this is 4k are we at an illegal do not enter bro we are just I don't even know I don't even know why we're here we're definitely gonna get securitized Oh, this is a big hill. I don't even know if I can make it up here. In my car. I mean, we're here in my garage with all my cars. But do you know what I love more than cars? Knowledge. Knowledge. Oh, that's a little bit too dark. Why am I on a parking garage in the middle of social distancing? Why am I not using a proper camera? I don't know. What is the point of this video? I have no idea. So, what's up? Uh, it's currently the Corona vlog. Whoa, I almost lost my stuff. Corona Diaries, uh, entry number th entry number one. I'm out of breath. Wow, I have not exercised in days. Yeah, we're on the phone because it's more natural. I don't have to try as hard, and it kind of makes sense with what I want to talk about. So I'm doing a lot of drugs recently, legal drugs. I'm doing a lot of thinking of like just stuff. I'm watching a lot of YouTube. Usually, how do I how do I fix this? All right, sick. Let's just do that. Yeah. Oh, this is be fucking better than. No, how do I get some good angle? Oh, that's a sick angle there, boys. What am I saying? I don't even know. There we go. Some good geometry app happening. Uh, what am I saying? Oh, yeah. Look at the CN Tower over there. You want to see the CN Tower, boys? Boys, where's the CN Tower? I can see it. Can you guys see it? I don't even know. Is it over there? Wait, is that it there? The fuck? Yo, the CN Tower doesn't even exist. Anyways, um, nobody cares about the CN Tower. This is not a tourism class picture. Right, I'm still trying to happen. figure out this whole vlogging on a phone thing. Uh, what am I saying? Yes. So, been watching a lot of YouTube videos of other people. Not really that much fitness. I've also been doing a lot of drugs. Uh, that doesn't matter though. And um, oh yeah, not really posting on on like fit, fitness on Instagram and stuff because honestly, like I realized that when you cut out, I don't know. 
I feel like when you cut out the things that are around you that aren't like that necessary, you start to like change who you are. The other thing I want to talk about is like this whole Corona virus situation. Are we even recording? Okay, we are. This whole coronavirus thing, um, it's kind of like, it's kind of similar to like being depressed. But the thing about me is like, I was depressed for like, like badly depressed for like years. Um, and I didn't really leave my house. <laughs> Just like now. So now like, after I somewhat got my life together and um, like I'm not as depressed mentally, I'm literally in the same situation. And the reason I want to talk about fitness is because I feel like the, what's with this wind? I don't like the wind. I think fitness was like the only thing I had going for me in terms of like positivity or like interests. So I kind of like latched on to the fitness thing. And then I slowly realized like over the past like four weeks or whatever, that like I'm a regular person and None of this video is really gonna make that much sense. So we should probably just go to the roof or something and check that out. Is it raining on the roof? This was a terrible mistake. Let's go in here. Ooh, look at the stair stairway, boys. Whoa, urban explorer. Where's the cameras at? Okay, we're safe. There's no cameras around here. Um, okay, well this is, this is vibey. Look at this vibey view. What's down here, boys? Suicide? Just kidding. Um, what are we talking about? Fitness. I don't like the echo in here. I'm so indecisive, even with my phone. Um, yeah, what are we talking about, boys? Okay, so that's way too windy. Let's go back somewhere else where it's not as windy. Great vlogger, 10 out of 10 YouTuber. I need to probably break because we're going down a ramp. Social distancing on elevators. Please keep your physical distance on elevators. Two meters apart. Bro, the elevators. One more time. Do it. Nice. Boys, this is where I recorded like a how to bulk five easy steps video back in like 2017. Oh, hi people, today I want to talk about bulking. I think I'm just gonna stay here and rant with you for a bit while this annoying heater makes too much noise. Let's go over here. Maybe it'll be quieter. All right, here we go, boys. Perfect. Echo, we got some blue background there. Okay, what are we talking about? So, we realize that our life, we don't know what we're doing with our life. Is there too much of an echo in here? Let me just, uh, let me just YOLO repeat my words or something like that. Um, we realize we don't really know what we're doing with our life. We're working at a minimum wage job. We have a YouTube channel, pretty much just post fitness stuff. And if we don't have anything fitness related, we feel kind of like, awkward or like forced to put fitness content out when I really actually don't give that many F's about fitness. Like I, I have the Greek God physique. I go to the gym. I generically, ge generic, generally talk about fitness and stuff. But like I've realized like I don't know what I'm doing with my life. And long story short, I feel like I've kept a lot of like stuff like hidden because it wasn't like like about my life that it wasn't really like relevant to fitness or like I didn't know if it was gonna be point, a point, what am I saying? I also don't know if anyone's watching. I have like a YouTube channel, but like I don't know if anyone actually watches and cares about my life. And it's kind of like narcissistic to assume people do, but I feel like I was forcing too much fitness stuff and like forcing the videos and like I didn't even know like what my style was, like what am I supposed to post about? Cause I don't really have like that typical fitness person thing. That's why I'm on the phone as well, um, because I just feel like it's more natural. I could be like more myself. And I honestly like, I've been watching a lot of YouTubers who just like document their life. And it looks like super boring probably like to them, but then I'm like entertained and watching it. And then that also relates to like, like the style of the video. So long story short, as soon as coronavirus is over, I'm leaving, I'm going to Indonesia. I'm going to Bali for like one month, two months. I don't know how long, and it's just to like do stuff. Okay. So that was what I was talking about in like a previous video, like, oh, I'm going away somewhere. Like, we're gonna go to Indonesia, and we're just gonna like do some stuff, like jump off a cliff and like, I don't know, ride a motorcycle and like just do stuff like that. And I realized that like, I spent a lot of time during the last like, you know what, next location. Yo, I spent, I spent a lot of time watching different people's like YouTube content, like Bali, like cinematic videos and like, inspirational travel vlogs 
because like I was into that kind of thing. But then I realized like, what? Do you, well, that's a lot of wind, boys. Like I realized like there's a lot of like different styles of vlogs. I don't even know what I'm doing in life. Like I don't know, like I don't have the equipment to make a fancy video. Like I don't know if I'm, is that even worth it? Shut up. And I thought like, I don't know. I think I just had way too much free time. And I was basically just like trying to figure out like how can I make some like epic travel videos that didn't even feel like it was authentically me. And I think that was the problem. Like, I don't know. Like I watch, I watch a lot of like, you know, fancy YouTube cinematic, like just stuff. And then I think like, oh, this is what I have to be. I realized like maybe it's not what I have to be maybe, maybe I should just like be completely 100% me because then I don't feel like I'm forcing things and then you end up with videos like this where it's like I'm on a bicycle in the rain with my phone instead of like my actual camera and like worrying about like what b-roll to get and like it's just not like fun and I wouldn't really enjoy doing it it almost feels like work and um, I don't know what I'm doing with my life, and I don't know if YouTube's gonna go anywhere. But I also feel like if it is, I should just like post the stuff I want and be completely myself. Like I was myself, like Pickering Fitness is still me, but I feel like Pickering Fitness is only like 5% of me and I'm not able to be the other 95% with like the content I previously posted. So this video is actually going way smoother than I was expecting. I was expecting a complete nonsense like the nofab video where that was like more so me but it's still kind of like incorporated stuff but yeah oh yeah transition into the whole nofab thing Delicious. 8.01 p.m. So boys, uh, welcome to the bath. Welcome to the continuation of the video. Uh, what were we talking about before our breakfast of eggshells interrupted? We had the nofap thing, so we're still doing nofap. Pretty sure it's like day 26 of nofap. If you don't know what nofap is, Google that shit. I'm not gonna explain it here. And pretty much I feel like, um, I feel like the nofap thing is like, I don't know. We're going strong. I feel like it's caused me to like not really give that many f about like what people think anymore. To the point where like I'm just vlogging in the bathtub, like just being real. And I'm not trying to like put on an act or like hide things because like this is the vlog now as opposed to like Welcome to the vlog. We're talking about tracking your macros and the proper angle to get the lateral deltoid activated. So we're just here now. And that's why like the videos are going to kind of be more like more often and more, I don't know. They're just gonna, I just, I'm just not concerned about exposing my life. Get your mind into the gutter. Why are we so bright? Check out these eyes. We still got the same jokes though. Eye store jokes. Zoom in on my face, get some zoom out action. Focus on my face, thank you. Um, why are we looking all red? I don't know, anyways. This was supposed to be a longer clip. I'm kinda confused now. I was supposed to have more to say, like, got some new charcoal here. Some new charcoal, so I think it's making my nose black though charcoal face wash so yeah that's why we're gonna go to bali uh that's the, nothing to do with what we're talking about but basically um not giving a fuck what people think and just like documenting your life not trying to put on a show not trying to um what's the word what's the word what's the word what's the word bird is the word ba -ba 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 bird ba -ba -ba -ba. what if i drop the camera in the bathtub <laughs> that'd be a waste of my money oh wait i don't know um yeah so we're just gonna record some stuff, live our life, come for the ride, or unsubscribe. <laughs> that doesn't even rhyme, Pickering Fitness. All right, um, see you guys later. I'm gonna go like conclude the video now. Yo, this video was weird. I just spent like the rest of the bath thinking like, why are we so lit up? Why are we so pale? Um, that's not what we were thinking about in the bath. Can we have like some not so bright stuff? What's this do? Anything? Oh, whoa. Did I actually fix it? I don't even know. Anyways, um, yeah. I feel like the videos from now on are like me rediscovering like who I am. It's like a 
a journey of trying to figure out who I actually am um, and like what I like and what makes me happy and what kind of videos I just make as a reflection of who I am. And I almost feel like to make this video, I had to like not give a fudge about not giving a fudge what people think, if that makes sense. Because this video is like super relaxed and like super easy to make, even though the topics are like super in depth and like kept me up all night last night basically but yeah from here on out it's just gonna be like whatever the fudge i want to post so probably gonna post like a 30 day no fab video probably gonna get a little bit of views but probably not but that's why i'm doing it maybe i'll get some views maybe i'll get some subscribers maybe i'll get some stuff because god forbid i try to achieve greatness on youtube also gonna just like post some corona vlogs because like maybe i'll shave my head i give myself a haircut video just stuff like that that i probably couldn't be able to like videos like that where i can't really like do only fitness because i don't really care about fitness that much sure i'll include like a workout at home but my life is now more than that and like i want it to be more than that because i need just freedom i need to feel like i can just express myself creatively whenever i want and i should probably end this video because it's already going on for way too long just like every video of mine so without further ado try out the new outro no more of this like super in-depth edm music with like lifting footage now it's just some like weird visco white girl like 13 year old girl outro aesthetic thing i don't know i'm just going through a weird phase maybe it's a phase or maybe it's me i don't even know but peace love and tranquility and i'll see you in the next video guys <sighs> new outro time bye